When I get to see the logs floating on the Fraser River, it reminds me of my part in this whole operation. Most of the logs that you see, they pass through the machines that I help build. As a machinist, being a part of that process, it's a really good feeling. In high school, I wasn't quite sure what direction I wanted to go in. The traditional way of being in the classroom it didn't always fit my personality. My mom was an employment counselor at the time. She knew that there was going to be a big boom for trades, and she knew that my personality would probably be a great fit. She was one of my greatest influences to get into the trades, so I began to explore my options. I found that WorkBC could really help people kind of find the right fit in the trades. I was really intrigued by the machinist trade. With my personality and my eye for detail, I knew I would be a good fit. I'm very grateful for all the opportunities that I've been given. I think about my family and how far we've come in just two generations. My grandma, for instance, she's a residential school survivor. She couldn't pursue her dreams and her education like she wanted to. I use her as my motivation every day to always work hard. My first day of school, it was very exciting. I remember just thinking to myself, like, wow, like how far I've come and how excited I am for the new journey ahead. And as I began my apprenticeship, what really appealed to me was the whole earn as you learn aspect. You take your schooling and you come out of it debt free. My self-confidence went up and just the feeling that I'm doing something with purpose, that's what really pushed me to get my red seal. Once you have your ticket, you have the freedom of choice. One of the precision parts that I make helps build the buildings and houses that we all live in today. It's cool seeing firsthand what kind of impact I have. Today I'm a Red Seal machinist and I want to keep building things that matter.